Our second stop is the Coastal Plains region. The Coastal Plains are mostly flat land that lies alongside an ocean. Coastal Plains cover nearly one-third of the state of Texas. This is the Piney Woods of East Texas. It was once home of the Caddo Indians. Our state bird, the Mockingbird, lives here. They got their name from their unique ability to copy or mock other birds. The pecan tree is also found here. It is a state tree of Texas. Weather in the Coastal Plains region is usually mild. That means the winters are short and warm compared to other parts of the country. Summers are long, hot, and humid. There are lots of rivers and lakes in this region, perfect for fishing and water sports. The coastal plains of Texas lie alongside an ocean. All rivers that flow west drain into the Gulf of Mexico. Many people visit the beaches that lie along Texas. Shipping is a huge industry in this region. Corpus Christi and Houston have huge ports where ships from all over the world visit to load and unload goods. Farming and ranching are important industries in the Coastal Plains region. Oil is found in the Coastal Plains region. These tall structures are oil derricks. Many people call the oil found in Texas black Texas tea. But be warned, do not drink it. Many large cities are located in the coastal plains, including Dallas, Austin, and Houston. Although Austin is our state's capital, Houston is the state's largest city. Houston is also the fourth largest city in the U.S. Okay, everyone, back on the bus again. Make sure you took plenty of notes. And remember, this region is located in southern and eastern Texas. This region is very flat, so it's very easy to build large cities like Houston, Dallas, Austin, Corpus Christi, San Antonio, and Laredo. This region gets the most rainfall in Texas. It's also very hot and has mild winters. Farming, ranching, shipping, and oil are the largest industries in this region.